it's very hard when you live in a place that's designed to oppress you. And so, you know, a lot of black youth, a lot of black students don't have access to education. And so, you know, they're cut off kind of at the root to be able to be educated. And we all know when you're not educated, you're not really paid attention to, people don't listen to you. And so when you go to voice those concerns, you know, people are like, oh, those are just wild people. They just tripping, they don't have any education. And so, you know, that's another um, tear of the frustration is this constant talking, this constant, you know, there's a problem here, this constant, you know, showing and telling and demonstration, but it's not being responded to because people don't feel that black people are important. America promoting democracy in all these foreign countries, but you're denying blacks, Hispanics, and poor whites they, they, they due process and equal protection here in America. You, you, you use CNN and, and all these major news stories when they were doing Arab Spring, when they was rioting over in Egypt, when they was rioting over in Syria. Well, you got problems right here in America. The same rights that they want over there, we want right here. And if our government ain't gonna give them to us, it's the people's right to take it. Democracy was born on civil disobedience. Father God, once again, we humbly come to your throne of grace. You said, O oh Lord, in yes, 2 Chronicles Lord. chapter 7, yes, verse 14, Lord. that if my people yes, who are called by my name yes, shall humble themselves, yes, pray, God, we come seeking your faith and we're turning from our wicked ways. Yes, sir. Then shall we hear from heaven. Yes. And our land yes. Yes, shall be healed. Thank you, Lord. Bless us, O oh Lord. Bless us. In the name of Jesus to Christ, I do pray. As we all stay together in agreement. Amen. 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 So then, only the know if I can bring myself to tell my people not to be angry, not to be violent, not to be. Because you've proven to us once again that black lives aren't valuable. And, and you're proving to us right now that you're complaining about four cop cars being damaged and some glass windows being broken during a Saturday protest when there was a young man killed by cops. So now you're telling me that property is more valuable than his life. I don't feel safe like that because they can just do anything around like, they said if we don't be in the house at around like 10 o'clock out curfew, they gonna, they gonna start shooting us and try to kill us. That's not good. They, the really person they really need to try to catch is the bad people and the robbers and that they they not doing it. They just killing innocent people and they didn't do nothing. That's not right.